let us enjoy my beloved mom, Mrs. Theodora Gutierrez, delightful food, recipes in this beautiful cookbook, Mom and Chef, Nana and Nana Theodora of Philippines Cuisine, cookbook, recipes, available worldwide online, in ebook, Kindle, paperback format, and at her daughter, Yes, that's me speaking to you about the video. Juanita de Guzman Gutierrez, Amazon author, Central Page. And my beloved mom, I would like to tell you, because I love my mom, as you as well, and now our dad. My mom is the only girl in her family, former beauty queen in our hometown, the first woman ever elected public official, as well, in our hometown, and own a student canteen restaurant, proposed and founded with other government officials, the first and only public high school where I, their daughter, because my dad was also twice leader, town, very popular as well on the top nurture, approved the school budget. And here, I was also elected the youngest teacher association president before I moved in the city schools of Manila and in New York City School here in the USA where I am. And my beloved parents own a yacht, private yacht or a huge fishing boat with crews of engineers and cooks that caught huge seafoods and they named their private fishing yacht boat St. Anthony because when they were newly married, my beloved parents were newly married, during World War II they were hiding from the soldiers, the Japanese soldiers, and St. Anthony protected them. St. Anthony spread his brown cloak, and so the Japanese soldiers were not able to see my beloved parents, and they were saved. Mom is a devotee of St. Anthony of Padua since she was a little girl, and St. Anthony saved him. I wrote these miracles as well in my other book, Missing People, Animals, Things Go to Anthony. And thank you, St. Anthony and my beloved parents are very, very happy about St. Anthony, very proud of St. Anthony, very loving to St. Anthony. And more delicious food recipes, way of life, development traditions, Tagalog learning are in this beautiful cookbook, Mom and Chef, Nana Nene Teodora of Philippines Cuisine. Cookbook recipe is available worldwide online in ebook, Kindle, paperback format. And at their daughter, yes, that's me speaking to you about the video. Juanita Nicosman Gutierrez, Amazon author, central page. And my mom is showing her in our new kitchen when we were growing up. A gift to her by my beloved dad, a new house that my beloved, our beloved relatives and neighbors are saying it is the Malacanang Palace because, presidential palace, because that was the biggest and the most beautiful at the part of the town during that time. So let's enjoy a beautiful Philippine recipes of my beloved mom. And here are the ingredients. But first, let me show you the name of the dish. This is my own handwriting as I am a calligrapher in my school. I handprint the diploma of my students here in New York City, USA, where I am a school teacher. And this Philippine dish is called veggies. Since I'm a vegan now, I am going to use all vegetables here. So I call this this veggies 
lechon. It's a Spanish word that means roasted because the Philippines, formerly Mahavlika, M A H A R L I K A, the Philippines was colonized by King Philip of Spain for more than 350 years. That's why all our words are Spanish. And then when I went to Madrid and Spain, and I traveled to Europe with my mom, they know the Philippines understand Spanish because I speak to them in Spanish as well. We had Spanish in my high school in the University of the East. I studied high school, my brothers and sisters studied elementary and high school in the University of the East as well in Manila, Philippines. And we had Spanish in the elementary and high school and in the university. And then so most of our Philippine language is Spanish, so this is lechon. And we call in Tagalog spelling, lechon. I wrote a book, Speak Tagalog as well. So I'm going to tell you first syllable, lit, second syllable, son. Lit, son. That's the Philippine Tagalog word for lechon. And this is all vegan. And it is a roasted or inihaw in Philippine Tagalog language. E, first syllable. Ni, second syllable. How, third syllable. Inihaw. That's why my dad, who used to be a USA stenographer typist in, here in the USA where I am for so many years, when he meant to say roasted, he will say anyhow. Because He's a great English speaker as well. He has been a USA stenographer, typist here in the airport in the USA for more than 25 years. So he speaks English very well. So when he wants to say anyhow, he will say anyhow. So this is veggies lechon, litson in Philippine, is in Tagalog language, or anyhow. My dad will say anyhow, or roasted. And then the ingredients that I will roast are Brussels sprouts. And then we have cauliflower. And then we have sweet potato. Sweet potato is so very good for our memory and lots of vitamins as well. And of course, these vegetables are very good for us. Lots of vitamins, the Brussels sprouts, as well as the cauliflower. Very good. Lots of vitamins and minerals, especially for women and for everyone as well. I am very sure. And then, we're using the sweet mini peppers. This is called sweet mini peppers because it is not too spicy. So that's why I included the seeds. And the seeds are good for all of us. And then we are going to use lemon. And also, we're going to use virgin coconut oil, organic. And this is a product of the Philippines and packaged in the USA. And I grew up in the Philippines. I was born in the Philippines. And our house and the Philippines is just beautiful with coconut trees. And I always remember my brothers and all our neighbors will climb the coconut trees when they want to get coconut fruits and so delicious and my mom will just break them happily. So the Philippines, pack, product of the Philippines package in the USA, virgin coconut oil. Delicious this side of heaven. And then we're going to mix in minced onions 
as well as oregano leaves. Very, very, very important for our good health. And then pure ground black pepper, as well as garlic powder and Himalayan salt as well and a touch of let me shake it because the mother vinegar is at the bottom apple cider vinegar and I'm going to include as well bay leaf for if this has beautiful scent and removes bacteria as well and then I'm going to roast it in a pan with banana leaves we have so many banana leaves in the philippines but here in the usa where i am i just ordered this online in florida and the banana leaves have excellent aroma and very good taste as well if you have banana leaves it's beautiful amazing magic but if you don't, you could use a parchment paper as well. And then we are going to mix now the cauliflower. Whoops, excuse me, please. And also the sweet potatoes. Next is the Brussels sprouts. Next is the sweet mini peppers. We are going to let's see here. We're going to mix in virgin coconut oil. Mmm, this is so heavenly, delicious, very aromatic. If you are here with me, I'm inviting you all. Let's dine, let's eat, let's enjoy cooking. Then Mmm, the virgin coconut oil has a very beautiful, delicious scent as well. And this is very good for our heart. And also we are going to put a teaspoon of brown sugar. And a teaspoon of brown sugar as well. And then we have the black pepper. Mmm, I wish you're here with me. Come on and eat. Come on, let's cook. I'm inviting you all. The aroma is just perfect, especially when this is cooking. You could smell the beautiful aroma of the banana leaves, the garlic. All the spices and all our wonderful vegetables. So we have oregano leaves. Be sure to have this in all your food. Excuse me, please. Because this removes the bacteria, the bacteria as well. Then we will have minced onions. And then we will have the Himalayan salt. I bought this in Canada because my mom and my brothers and sisters live there. They are Canadians as well. And also my two brothers 
are in the Philippines, they just want to tour. They don't want to live in, the, in another country. And my eldest sister lives in California as well. And I'm here in New York, city USA. Now, let's just have a, let me show you, apple cider vinegar. Just a touch, maybe a teaspoon, a little bit. Beautiful. And then, we're going to mix them all together. This, mmm, this is so aromatically delicious, this side of heaven. I'm inviting you all. Come on, let's have fun cooking and eating and dining. You could smell the aroma of the apple cider vinegar, the garlic, the onions, the coconut oil, virgin coconut oil, and the Malayan salt, the onions, mmm, so heavenly, aromatic, delicious, and it's going to be so nutritious, it really is. Thank God, the universe, for providing us all these awesome, wonderful, amazing, magnificent vegetables. We thank also the plant kingdom, the animal kingdom, the angelic kingdom, ascended masters, for bringing us all this heavenly food and also our farmers for planting metro chakras happy when i am thanking all our beautiful fellow divine beings mm, the aroma is just fantastic this is heavenly delicious and so nutritious and then I think I have already incorporated. Mm, the aroma is just perfect. So everything now has been incorporated. Oopsie. I have to get the, the tongs. And then, this is still good, because this is clean. We're going to, excuse me please. We're going to put this all together in our tray with the banana leaves. Just like so, and then let me put this aside, and then let's arrange this a little bit. Oh my goodness, this is just fantastic, delicious, this side of heaven. And then, it's time to put this in our toaster oven for about 15 minutes or so to 30 minutes. Just as long as they are golden brown, it's all up to you to determine if you want it overcooked or half cooked, it's all up to you. And see you in my next video. We're going to enjoy this heavenly delicious veggie slit charm. One of my wonderful beloved mom's amazing food recipes in this gorgeous cookbook. Mom and Chef, 
Nana in Nana Theodora of Philippines Cuisine. Cookbook recipes available worldwide online in ebook, candle, paperback format. And at her daughter, yes, that's me speaking to you over the video. Juanita de Guzman Gutierrez, Amazon author, Central Page. Happy cooking, happy dining, enjoy life. Thank you for watching. See you again. And most of all, I would like to thank my amazing subscribers, family, worldwide, community, worldwide. And please subscribe if you have not already done so. And I appreciate you all as well, deep in my heart. Thank you for watching. See you again. Happy cooking.